Chinese ice cream won't melt even under the blowtorch. Chice cream says it uses an appropriate amount of carotenin as a stabilizer. Written by Keone Everington, Taiwan News staff writer. This is from the 8th of July, 2022. Meet Sinsen attempts to melt the ice cream with a blowtorch. Claims to be all natural ingredients. Feeling heat from Chinese consumers who are complaining that its product not only fails to meet at room temperature, fails to melt, I'm sorry, um, but it is even impervious to a blowtorch. Now here you can see Nitsitsen attempting to melt the ice cream. That's a Weibo screenshot there. Um, to get a close-up visual for you. The brand's most expensive ice cream product sells for 66 yuan. That's eight dollars and ninety-four nine dollars and eighty-four U.S. dollars, leading many Chinese consumers to dub the brand the Hermes of ice cream. In response to the controversy, Chice Cream on Wednesday, July six, posted on its Weibo account that its products comply with national food safety regulations. I beg to differ, darling. Stating that it uses carrageenan as a stabilizer in the product, pointed out that this carrageenan is derived from a red seaweed commonly known as Irish moss. However, some scientists have expressed concerns that consumption of this subject uh, could lead to inflammation, digestive problems such as bloating and irritable bowel disease and even colon cancer, reported Medical News Today. According to the news agency, there is controversy over whether there is a proven connection between carotene and consumption by humans in such medical conditions as the findings are based on animal and cell-based studies thus far. Coming to you live from Bullshit We Cut, you have a wonderful night.